Hi everybody, this is your friendly neighborhood Showa60. I want to thank you guys for getting me this far. We are really doing some great things. Thank you for your continued support. If you'd like to see more content from yours truly, be sure to not only subscribe, but hit the icon bell for more updates. And be sure to tell your friends about Showa60. With that out of the way, let's begin. Okay, so before we get started, there's something I gotta say. As of the day of this recording, Happy Thanksgiving to all of you who celebrate. And even if you don't celebrate, I'm thankful for you guys watching. This is your friend in Neighborhood Show 60, and I never thought I'd be able to do this, but it's kind of been a while since I've reacted to a video. The last time I did something like that was, I think, I think it was uh, CJ the Champ when he did the most disrespectful moments in anime history. It's nice to know that we have a lot more anime fans talking about their favorite work. Okay, so. Now, I would have done the reverse, but since YouTube likes to... likes to troll people who use Toei content, yeah, I think it's better safe than sorry, but... Now, there are two YouTubers that I've been keeping track of lately and they're one of them is Code Means Super and the other is Blank Boy. They also have a joint channel and uh, from by the looks of things they're about to do something incredibly intense. I'm so looking forward to sharing this with you. The link to their respective channels will be in the description. So there's that. So without further dicking around let's Get busy. Yo, I just robbed this dude in a wheelchair for mad shit. You want some? <laughs> Bro, what? At least tell me you let him keep his wheelchair. Nah, that <laughs> parked Blank outside was right wild. now. But hey, what you watching? Man, I'm watching Jurassic World 3. It's whack. No wonder this went certified paper plate in the box office. Man, we got move. <laughs> oh boy, like this dude. I feel it for him. Like, Dominion could have done better. Yeah, bro. We could probably f around and make a better trilogy. Hey, hold on, bro. You want to something? Walk with me. That brain blast. That brain blast. You do Vegeta versus Broly on your channel, and after that, I'll post a Goku versus Broly on my channel. And then on our Super and Blank channel, we do Gogeta versus Broly. Okay, first things first. I liked it when it was called Super Blank. Super and Blank, on the other hand. I don't know about that. But they're good channels, like... Their subscriber count is through the roof. You, like, please... Like, check out their channel right here. Like, check out both their channels. They're moving. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. This been a bang. bang. So all the Saiyans are just posing, staring at each other hard as hell. But we used to this, though. Goku's ass is always turned around somehow <laughs> after making a play. So I only got one question for you niggas. Frieza, are you still a bitch? Oh. Look at face. Oh. Mm. Yo, Black Boy. Black Boy is wild. He's wild for that one. And this camera doesn't like the focus. <laughs> Goku out here trying to make me look sweet in front of everybody. I can't go out like this. Shut up, you monkey. Damn. I saw you on IG talking about, I'm a snack. Who want me? The fuck type of snack are you? Pretzels, bitch? <laughs> Your bitch liked it, though. I'd bust both y'all asses. That's all I know. Pegasus is a hating ass nigga, though. So he and Vegeta with the stray. I know your ass not talking. Mm, man, fuck Vegeta. You gotta... Okay, actually, his name is Paragus, but the... Hey. A McDonald's oh. hairline, and even when you stand, you still at dick-sucking height. <laughs> oh, Vegeta no. looking up, thinking to himself like, damn. What'd what he what say he fuck, say me, fuck for? me for? Your father had all of us looking like bitches. And now that I'm thinking back, I'm not gonna lie, Pegasus is low-key cooking right now. King Vegeta did have all the Saiyans on their knees to a toddler, letting him call them racial oh, slurs Jesus. and everything. Broly's in the background getting tight for literally no reason, Damn. hitting the Hey Arthur fist. I swear, every Broly storyline could have been solved with some anger management therapy. 
and quickly because I have to. Can we just address how Goku and Vegeta got that shit on right now? They said if we going out, it's gonna be dripped out. Hey, Vegeta. Yeah, we gotta talk about their little winter winter getup real quick. Like, Capsicorn really hooked them up, first of all. But every time I go to a convention, I don't see anyone cosplaying as Goku or Vegeta with these fits on. Like, at all. Why? Like, if I go to a convention, especially since Anime Weekend in Atlanta is going to be in the winter season anyway, come 2024... I need to see cosplayers dressed up as Goku and Vegeta with these exact coats. Like, with these. Like, with these. I think the steroid head with the lesbian haircut is getting angry right Ooh. now because you don't got a swaggy jacket like the both of us. Hey, Broly, you gonna let them talk to you like that? Broly is seriously starting to get mad now, but he's not angry enough. We just need a little bit more instigating. Me, personally, I wouldn't let those monkeys RBC talk to me like that. Real. Vegeta tried to press me, and I brought him to tears 19 seconds into the fight. I don't know. Maybe that's just me, though. You spitting, little nigga. Broly, it's about time. Go, go! That's all Broly needed to hear to trigger him into turning up. He starts raging, charges into Vegeta first, who just blocks the punch and starts smiling. Vegeta is not scared of you, Broly. He's fought <laughs> against much worse. Have you seen how ugly Tapo is? Vegeta Damn. powers up and makes Broly go 0 for 3, swinging on the air as they both get engulfed in the ice and snow. These Saiyans are really strong because I just know it's brick out there. You could probably rob somebody with a water gun. The snow finally <laughs> clears out the way and look how Vegeta's in this bit posing. Arms crossed, one leg up, emoting on somebody mid-fight, not crazy? At least catch the W first. Vegeta wins <laughs> and kicks Broly so hard he done triggered a mutation because bent over like this is crazy. All fours is a sign of extreme desperation, but Vegeta's not recognizing the red flags that this nigga is crazy. You a fucking bum with these grandma punching animations. Tell Nappa I said what's good, punching Broly right in the face. Nah, Vegeta is really cooking right now. This about to be the best <laughs> W of his career. Oh, never mind. Toriyama uh, wrote this movie. Oh, uh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Let's bring that. Let's bring that ish back real quick. Mm. Like, the amount of times I've seen Dragon Ball with Vegeta in it, like, it's basically... Like Dragon Ball, as long as Toriyama is, as long as Toriyama is on the payroll, is essentially Vegeta can't catch a dub at life. Like, come on. Like let Vegeta have a consistent victory. That's not lasting long, man. Vegeta kicks Broly in the gut and then starts breakdancing, hunting him mad far away, and then goes in for the chase down. I'm not done with you yet. The last time Vegeta was confident like this was when he had the Hall of Fame fridge protector Goldo talking with his head off his shoulders. Mm -hmm. And then slaps Broly's hand away. Yeah, Stop touching niggas with your hands. hands! Goes to fly up and Broly beats him to the spot, blocking the punch. Nah, -uh. how he moving so fast out of nowhere? We gotta drug test his ass, he on PEDs. Goku on the <laughs> sideline recording the fight, cheesing, seeing Broly learn so fast because he knows it's gonna be his turn real soon. They start going hit for hit for a bit while flying up as Pegasus and Freezer start providing some elite commentary for us. Damn, Broly isn't dominating like I thought he would. His ass going up for adoption soon. Did you not train him before pulling up? Yeah, he was sparring with me for months in preparation. Ah, I see. So he's basically done no training at all if it was versus your bum-ass power level. Oh, Luckily, no. it seems he's learning quick. Frieza is just allergic to not being a bully. Give me your lunch money, nigga. <laughs> Broly's essentially matching base Vegeta right now until he's joinked in the head, knocking him back down to earth. And if there's anything we know about Saiyans is that they love to fight. Don't care about family, friends, having fun, taking a shower, nothing. They just don't know when to quit. So Broly just charges right back in and Stupid. oh, got his ass. <laughs> oh, oh, oh yeah, this y'all prince. That was Obviously clean. Pegasus is happy and I am too because this version of Broly is way better than this fraud. You mean to tell me he had all this pent up anger for years because Goku was crying a lot as a god? Oh. <clears throat> Not gonna lie. I'm kind of glad they fixed that because YouTube would have been on all of our asses. 
I mean, as if showing footage from a toy property isn't enough. Uh, boy, I'm going to have to put up the disclaimer real soon. Because uh, this is going to suck hard. A damn baby? That's what babies are supposed to do. Why weren't you crying more? You're, You're weird. weird. Broly starts holding on to his hands and look at Vegeta's eyes. I can see the homophobia just beaming right out of them towards the screen. He knows it's time to put an end to this sus shit. Starts squeezing the hell out of Broly's hands while pulling him into. I mean, let's just be real. If you're not into guys, you're not into guys. That's the whole deal. It's not homophobia. Say, nigga, you get. And uses his great. Okay, stating the blatantly obvious on the other hand. It is gift given to him by God. That beaming forehead, headbutting the shit out of him into a crazy right, sending him crashing through ice mountains. It's a great thing Saiyans always know to pick somewhere where there's no people. Let's go somewhere empty to fight. I bet. Two tickets to the Marvels, please. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Okay, first things first. To Miss Marvel, to her actress at least. You're cool peoples. You're cool peoples, like on God. But can we just be real for a second and just say that given the horrible nonsense that's been going on in social media, the details of which I will not discuss on this channel or at any or at any given point, but I will say this. The company that you're working for to be in these movies just needs some work. That's the nicest I can pull. That's the nicest thing I can say about it. I'm just being nice. That's it. And starts bopping his shit, dyeing his hair blonde, his ass think he Chris Breezy. Broly's just looking at him and it's like, wow, his aura is just insane, so magical. Oh my god, bro, is dick riding all you do? <laughs> Vegeta lets the cameraman get all the angles one last time and is locked in. And after laying his eyes on that, I'm gonna need all of y'all to pray for Pegasus. Nothing's wrong with him per se, he's just pussy. Oh my god, he's so beautiful. If you polishing his shits like that right now, just wait and see. These monkeys got like 18 more of these bitches. That's the only <laughs> reason they killed me, for real. Wow, I'm not gonna lie, that shit cold. I need me that. Oh bro got gray God, hairs and still out here trying to fit in with the new trends. <laughs> just let it go, bro. Well, no wonder. It's all old and dried out. Like that man right there. Ah, uh, these Spongebob memes are just... Fire. Broly begins to charge in at Vegeta and oh, got his ass. No, stupid. Oh, goes back in and gets kicked <laughs> damn near off screen, getting dribbled off the ice and gets kicked away again. Vegetaldo starts showing off why he deserved that max contract in the Saudi Arabian League, knees him into a kick to the chin and key blasts him right in the face. Vegeta's really on timing right now. If he wins this, then Jiren sunning him in front of all the universes gets erased from history. I am Vegeta, the prince of all sick. Prince of this dick, shut up, nigga. <laughs> oh. Jumps out the way of a punch and gives Broly CTV. Weave, key blast to the mouth, and I've never seen somebody in such a rush to go get beat up. Broly is relentless. Comes back in and gets death, but oh, nah. Vegeta's punches are made out of marshmallows now. What the hell? I put mad strength into that punch. Kakarot, let's jump this nigga. <laughs> and look at this evil- Really? Jumping? Jumping? That's- Okay, first of all, that's rare. And two... You're not- You're not Jujutsu Kaisen. Stick to 1v1s. Grin on Broly's face. Akira Toriyama's like, okay, bro. That's it. He gave Vegeta his hair nigga damn screen time, and now it's time to make the prince Who look the like the princess. Broly. Oh, oh, God, bro, why? <laughs> he 
He hits him with a nasty stomach punch into the mountain and follows it up, but luckily Vegeta's able to throw up the Wakanda forever and blocks it. And obviously this Broly is a lot better than the original fraud, but he did keep two qualities that I really like. And those are dragon niggas and being crazy. Cause look at the insanity in his eyes as he's punching Vegeta through the ice mountain, definitely cutting up his back. I've been watching DBZ long enough to know that once Vegeta starts losing, it's over for him. No comeback is coming. He is not LeBron. But since we're Hello everybody, this is your friendly neighborhood Showa60. You've probably seen a lot of my artwork on YouTube. How would you like to buy some artwork from yours truly? Well, we have a lot of cool options for the price as shown. But you better hurry. Space is limited. And if you got any questions, please hit up my Instagram. Also, the payment options are available at the bottom of the screen. So please pay close attention to those. Again, if you have any questions, hit me up on my Instagram. Remember, Payment first. They start boxing until Vegeta gets grabbed by the throat. <laughs> Weave and eats a key blast straight to his 12th pack. And right here. Right here is when I decided it was time to trade my Vegeta jersey for an Arizona and half a tuna sandwich. Cause right here is when Vegeta starts showing off his hidden talent that should have stayed hidden of running track. Now he's out here just looking like a bum, scary as hell. So much so that even Goku can't believe what he's seeing. Vegeta, what are you doing? Yamcha go take your bitch back at this rate. No. Vegeta starts to fly up to the sky while closing his eyes. And now it's time. What is a mortal to a god? Starts dyeing his hair red, getting on his little Uzi timing, turning Super Saiyan God for the first time. Slapping Broly in the face with his godly aura. Broly's head is spinning. He has not seen anything like this before. He had no mother, no other Saiyan friends. Watch the only homie he's ever had get offed by his pops. Look at him. The bitches was all over him and he didn't know what to do. Was spooked out there. So this reaction from him is very understandable. Vegeta ups it on Broly and bad hairline. Catching L's. Freezes bitch. <laughs> Midget. Avatar Vegeta is triggered because he starts busting out some moves we've never seen before. Starts air slash energy bending this man Broly away until he dodges two hits. And peep the sweat particles coming off Broly's face. Vegeta got this man stressed. And this is when Vegeta rips a page out of UI Goku's book, trying to turn into the Weave Nation Prince. Broly's just out here swinging angrily at absolutely nothing, while Vegeta clearly got his training from Floyd Mayweather. Floyd had Conor McGregor out here looking slow, and he's the nigga who's 46 and can't read. Vegeta catches Broly's punch like it's nothing, hitting him with a Kawhi Leonard face, loads up a mean punch hitting Broly right in the forehead. And if I had a dollar for every time during this fight, I thought Vegeta just had Broly completely outmatched, I'd have like $5, enough to live comfortably homeless. But in the context of this fight, that's a lot, because seeing the way Broly goes crashing through all these mountains, I thought he'd never stop until he crash lands on top of the mountaintop. Pegasus can't believe it. He thought Broly was finna be the number one overall pick. Actually came back with the milk for no reason. I spent my whole life savings for what? Just so he could be turned into a pack? Not gonna lie, I would go help him, but fuck that nigga. Listen, man, all I gotta say to Pegasus is... Shouldn't have been talking shit! <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you, gang. This shit over. I'm out before these niggas try to fight me next. I can't die again. Yeah, he's ass. But Broly been watching Nick 30 streams for too long now. They'll never back down, ne never what? Never give up. Broly, I have no more money. We spent it all on training. Get over here and fill out this McDonald's application. Plus, my new bitch gonna leave me, please. But Broly isn't listening to all that. He's done taking orders from Pegasus. Propped up on the mountain, raging, and Vegeta pulls up you talking more shit. Bitch ass nigga. Getting Broly really low tier god now? Tight. Broly, don't do this. I can't lose her because I'm a broke nigga. I don't wanna be outside the crib like Rigby. Yo, what the hell? Oh, that's just wild. Broly starts genuinely tweaking, and this isn't just anger anymore. This has now spilt over into straight insanity. And since Batman isn't here to do his job of beating up the mentally ill, Vegeta's gonna have to do it for him. No insane asylum can help you. <laughs> Yo, Vegeta, I didn't get a turn! Shooting a T-Blast as Broly just stands there screaming. 
Vegeta swear he just caught a W, Frieza's dipping with the Dragon Balls to wish for a longer tail, and Pegasus hopping on Tinder because he needed to try again with this making the legendary Super Saiyan shit, as Broly just flows to the bottom of the ocean. Brody didn't even make it 20 minutes into his own movie. It's just not safe in these Saiyan streets, man. But then, no, it isn't. through sheer brute strength, Broly is able to bypass hypothermia and drowning. And to be fair, we've seen Hit stop time and this bald bitch Jiren just flexed out of it. So this is on brand with the show. Broly erupts from out the water. His pure aura being so strong is parting the entire sea. He's on his Moses shit. The cameraman doing his job to make sure he getting the angles right, panning up, Why showing you Broly's trash like ass fit, and he's pissed right now. His scream alone is so powerful, it's got Goku and Vegeta holding on for dear life, trying to not go flying back. Man, Vegeta, the fuck is this? I don't know, but he's a demon. Ayo, call up that nigga Piccolo. <laughs> not gonna lie, Kakarot, you got your turn now, bro. Broly starts flying up, still screaming, and I, bro, we get it. You're an X fan. Gets up there, lifts up his head, and uses his mouth to shoot off a key blast. Nappa for sure looking up at this fight right now, telling everybody around him that that is his shit being stolen. <laughs> word for word, bar for bar. The key blast is able to oh miss Goku gosh. and Vegeta, but it was so powerful, it's got the both of them shook. And I get it. Broly has been upping his attributes 20 overalls every five minutes. In an hour, he gonna be out here solo V squad, giving the pride troopers fits. Vegeta sees how much strong he's gotten, and it's like, hmm, time to charge in. Punching Broly, and he doesn't even budge, as Vegeta Vegeta's eyes shrink to the size of a skittle, and he gets punched dumb far away. Broly turns on the jets to catch up to his prey, and they both are trying to swing on one another, just taking Stupid. turns chucking up air balls. Oh, Vegeta no. got that look like he's seen a ghost now. And on the sidelines, both of the spectators got two very different expressions. <laughs> that monkey is dead! Not gonna lie to you, gang. We next. Damn, nigga, what the fuck I do? Don't matter. His ass is just hating now. Broly's delirious. When he's done with them, he about to start tweaking out on us. And then this is when the match ends in the most abrupt way possible. Broly punches Vegeta as he blocks it and lands onto the ground. And that's it. That's the fight. I now hand the baton over to you, CNS, for Goku versus Broly. I'll see y'all on Super and Blank for the finale. Broly versus Gogeta. Okay, so, no, let's get one thing straight. I've seen this movie, and eh, the animation was phenomenal. The fight scenes, I don't, I don't know what positive thing to say about it. All I know is that it's good. Like. It's a fantastic movie, and uh, I never thought I'd see the day th that somebody would cover this. Except, I've seen dozens of videos like this. It's just that whenever it's like Blank Boy or Codename Super, it's like, theirs are the funniest to me. But, again, the links to their channels will be in the description below. And, um... Let me know in the comments what you think. Oh yeah, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, again, I'm doing commissions, so there's that too. With that, this is your friendly neighborhood Showa, and I will catch you in the next video. That is, if I don't get content ID for showing Dragon Ball footage. Matane!